Mr. Mandela was arrested for 27 years in Robben Island. He was denied the right of movement. All hearts to reawake their lion heart. We are calling all hearts to be the voice of a lion. We are calling all hearts to stand up for their lion hearts. Let's unite the world. Let's unite the world. <coughs> The fact that white lions have a significant cultural importance to the local Tsonga and Sepedi communities makes it an ideal capstone animal for protecting all lions in the wild as well as the entire environment and the UNESCO declared Kruger to Canyon's biosphere. As the lion roars at Timbabati, the they are resembling our ancestors. They are teaming with us. So having the lions is always a reminder to us that we should be the true leaders, not leaders who are self-centered, leaders who are selfless, who serve others. I never saw a lion with my, my eyes, but today I saw lions with my eyes. Eyes. A lion is a born leader. Like myself, I'm a born leader. I stand behind the United Front. Because Lions are in crisis, which means that they'll be under even greater threat from trophy hunting and the ever-increasing lion bone trade. I've worked as an APU officer for five years, and uh, what I've witnessed in this industry, I can't even explain. Uh, but uh, what the poachers are doing is nothing compared to what the government is doing. I get for a new park work. Ons het daar wel pie gehad wat ons met die hand groot gemaakt het. Toe hy te groot was om interaksie met kliënte te doen. Die wel pie toe opgeëindig in Bloemfontein by die bounterheid. Um, mense wat die, wat die, die um, leeuw slag. Hy leeuw het vir twee dagen. And a hawk so is die. Net die half van hierdie hawk het hulle om aangehou. Hy het vir twee dae het hy nie geëet of gedrink nie. 
nie. Dit is onmenselijk. Jij gaat niet. Jij gaat dit niet in jouw kind niet. Jij gaat dit niet in jouw hond doen nie. Hoe kan jij zo so iets doen? Terwijl die dame daar was, is hij toen geschiet binnen in die hok. Die lijn buitenrijd, ze mensen is bezig om ons lieus uit te wis. Behind me are the holiest animals in Africa, the white lions of Timbavad. I'm Sibusi Songoveni, a trained environmental officer. And here's what I'm going to tell you. You killing our heritage, you killing our children's heritage. It cannot be allowed to happen. It was in the same building in the year 2008 that it was gazetted in a colloquium chaired by the then national chairperson of the Portfolio Committee, Honorable Maniwa Maklangu, that our government would protect our sacred white lions as a living heritage. I ask you, Honorable Chairman, to consider that gazette. We have been engaging as an organization, as a stakeholder in this process since 2002. Today I have been authorized to speak on behalf of South Africa's traditional healers of the Tsonga and Sapeli people surrounding the Kruger National Park. But I know I speak on behalf of all traditional healers globally who treat nature with love and respect. Whenever a traditional council is called worldwide, it is just and, and right that the silent stakeholder in a debate is granted a chair. So I hereby do that now. Who will speak for the lie? This is the traditional way of a gathering. And since our Minister of Environmental Affairs is not here today, I address the department. I ask you, who authorized the legalization of this lion slave trade? Who authorized the legalization of the mass killing of our lions for blood money? And who legalized the killing of our living heritage? Let me answer for you. It has not been authorized. Stop killing what is secret to the poor people. So this is my plea, Mr. Chairman, honorable members. Let us stop killing the lion. Because you're killing the Koisa once you kill the lion. It's like we say in our language, Atua Tama Kanske. I must say it. Atua Tama Kanske. I must say it. I must say, honorable members, the struggle continues. continues as from today that we as the poor people will protect what is ours. And I thank you. Ganga. Ganga. Ganga.
who go around destroying your creation. of life and that includes wildlife and particularly at this time we consider the risk faced by wild white lions we thank you for those who make public this horrendous risk and pray that they will succeed in saving all of your wildlife but especially in this instance white lions we pray these prayers in the glorious name of your Son. Amen. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.